All right, guys, today we're back in the garage working on the Pontiac Fiero, AKA Fox Ferrari, Ferrari kit car. And today we're gonna to be installing this new GT Grant steering wheel. Got the little logo here. This is the ultra suede version, which I really like. We got our installation kit here, along with the little adapter here. So right here is the original Fiero steering wheel, which it's not in horrible shape, but I'm just not a huge fan of it. First, we gotta pop this off, which on the Fiero, there's a little notch right here at the bottom. You just pull, that comes right off. And then now we gotta get this little, little horn switch here. You just turn it and it pops out. And then there's a spring behind that. So we got our horn button and our little spring here. And then now we gotta get this off, little clip. Alrighty, so I got these little pliers here and we're gonna take out the little clip here. And we'll set that to the side. All right, now we gotta get our nut off. All right, now I got a 1316 socket and a little breaker bar. We're gonna go ahead and take the, the main nut off the steering wheel. There we go. There's our main nut. Let's set it to the side. Oh, it's stuck in there. Come on. All right, so we got our nut off. Now we have to get our puller and our puller will screw into these two holes here and that'll help us pull the steering wheel off because it's a press fit. We got our steering wheel puller mounted. You basically just screw this big bolt into the center of the, the steering, where the bolt goes on the steering wheel. And then these two bolts on the side screw in beside it. And then you just crank this down with a wrench and it'll pop the steering wheel loose. So let's do that now. Alrighty, let's crank this string wheel off of here. Boom, and it's loose. That's it. Alright, here's a little side-by-side -side comparison of the original Fiero wheel versus the GT Grand. They almost look similar. I just like this soft suede though. Let's see here. And it's a little bit smaller. Just like maybe an inch smaller. And it's a lot lighter. The GT Grand is like, weighs nothing. All right, here's the instructions on how this goes together. We got our little adapter here and cover and miscellaneous items here. So, So here it is on the car. So here's the little cover that covers up the adapter. The adapter's underneath here. And then this is like another adapter. So the steering wheel will bolt to this. And then these three bolts hold it to the adapter. And then we got our uh, main nut with the little clip that holds it in there. And then here's our horn button. So everything's there. And then we got this little cover here. I'm not sure which way that goes. I guess it can go either way. Let's see if that goes there. And then now we just belt on our steering wheel and we'll be good to go. Alright, this is the most satisfying part right here. I gotta take it back off. I forgot to put this little ring in there that holds the um, centerpiece in there. Alrighty, now it's time for the icing on the cake. And oh, that's a tight fit. I actually don't have the horn hooked up yet. I gotta figure that out later, but 
That's it. It's in there. It's kind of spaced out quite a bit further than I think the original was probably a little bit closer, but we'll sit in here and see. Let's see. It's definitely a little bit further this way, but I think it'll I think it'll be fine. Just have to drive it, see if see if it feels weird. Alright guys, so that's how you change the steering wheel on a Pontiac Fiero. Alright, here's the steering wheel in action. GT Grant, baby. Oh yeah, feels way more like a race car now. <laughs> 